4K at CES. Well, a year ago, the 2015 CES, what you basically had was 4K debuting and everyone got excited about it. At the 16 CES, what we're gonna see is huge 4K sets that are, well, let me think, flatter, thinner, better looking. Yeah, they're gonna have pretty 4K sets, but they're also gonna have 4K sets that have high dynamic range and wide color gamut. And that's actually super important because it's gonna allow you to see breathtaking pictures using traditional display technology. Now, WCG and HDR, which are wide color gamut and high dynamic range, actually are a new technology that's not fully agreed upon. But as we get closer, what we're going to see is imagery and content that is truly breathtaking and can't be found in traditional television. You'll have to get it over the top through Netflix or Amazon or a content provider who's making 4K content. But when you watch it on a 4K set that has high dynamic range and wide color gamut, you'll be experiencing video unlike any other video you can get in any other place. Better than the movie theater, better than a traditional TV set, better than regular HD, something you've actually not been able to see anywhere and won't be able to see anywhere until regular cable systems can provide a 4K signal, which won't be anytime soon.